All right, so rear uppercut. My favorite punch. It's a punch that's a, it's like a video game punch. It's like the punch, it's like that super move you wanna use. I love this punch. When used correctly, it's super powerful. You can follow it into combinations. To me, one of the funnest punches you could throw. So we started off just like a cross. The feet are the same when throwing a cross. I have to get my feet moving. If I'm just throwing this, again, I'm losing my leg drive, okay? So I'm stepping into my target with my hands up. I'm squatting almost like I'm slipping. So I'm basing, almost looking like a body jab. And then I'm releasing my hips forward like a cross and then the arms. So I step in slow motion. I step in, right foot starts to come and I release the hips upwards. Again, try not to scoop out of the sand. Scooping out of the sand again, it leaves that little time. It's the drop of the body, then the release. So I'm not showing lots of targets. Again, incorrect, sand, still can be super powerful. Rock the body to the side before throwing. Short drop, shoot. So again, step, drop, release the hip. And then I'm back to position. Again, step in, release the hip, and shoot. And back to position. So throwing an uppercut, make sure you stay safe. Again, front is punch to throw, most dangerous for them if you land it. Most dangerous, easiest punch to leave yourself open.